night, a deadly shooting outside a local ATM. Good evening. I'm Sheree Palello. And I'm Mike Dardis. Right now, two gunmen are on the loose, and they've already proven that they're willing to kill to get what they want. WLWT News 5's Allison Montoya leading the way live in Roselawn, where a man working on an ATM was shot to death. Allison, this appears to be a crime of opportunity. Yeah, that's right. A woman we talked to that doesn't want to show her face on camera tonight said she saw two guys in hoodies actually come up to this worker here at this ATM, told the guy to get on his knees and shot him. But police right now, they're not confirming that for us. But police, they also tell me these people, they're not in custody and they're still working on trying to figure out who they are. So police are still here at the scene in Roselawn at this ATM. It's located in the 7100 block of Redding Road. At this hour, police can only confirm for us one person. Person is dead. I'm told the man was working on this ATM when he was shot at least once around one o'clock. Police right now are interviewing witnesses downtown at CIS. One woman told me she saw again two men in black hoodies shoot the man and then they took off running. People I talked to around this scene are upset, of course, at what happened and are hoping police make a quick arrest. This guy woke up with you know, an intention to come back home. I mean, I don't know his family or nothing like that, but he might, he actually seen somebody at work this morning. He's seen his kids, he's seen his wife. I don't know if he has it or not, but he's not coming back. And of course, another live look at the scene here as police investigate this deadly shooting. And I'm told the victim's identity, it's not going to be released for some time tonight, but police say he was a father and husband. Reporting live from Roselawn, Allison Montoya, WLWT News 5.